Hi, I'm Samhita. My name is Maximilian Chavez. My name is Carmelita Lee. Our product for today is for children with autism because they find it extremely hard to identify their emotions and cope with stress. We created the Beta Band, which is essentially a headband. It reads your beta waves, which fall in between a certain like low and high beta wave. And if you're outside that range, then your brain is not acting as a normal brain. Project event has definitely impacted my uh, sense of teamwork. I can collaborate a lot more with my peers, have that like uh, design thinking into mind. How can we um, target our users and have the best influence and the greatest impact on their lives? Working and coding and doing all that stuff, it gave me a chance to be familiar so that I'm not as intimidated going into college and I'm, it's actually like made me a lot more excited for freshman year of college. We've definitely like opened our minds up a lot more and we've learned how to like cope with maybe our product not working and still like learning from our mistakes. Having interacted with uh, people who are on the spectrum, uh, young adults and little children and seeing what they go through um, and understanding their experiences and then being able to put that into a product, um, engineer something, and then see that like truly affect them and help them. A lot of people try and create products for people that they don't even like, they, they never even talked to before. So some, we had a lot of things that we thought would be good, but after talking to people who actually use wheelchairs, they were like, that like, we don't have problems with that. So it just like, you really should talk to people and get to know them before you like make assumptions about things that they struggle with. I think the impact has been huge and it's changed my outlook towards education for project-based learning and education uh, a lot actually. The reason is is because prior to Project and Invent I focused a lot on just developing technical skills and having the students learn laser cutting, 3D printing, soldering, sort of for the sake of learning 3D printing, laser cutting, and soldering. But working with Project Invent and anchoring these technical skills to a real-world problem has really I think made the learning experiences more meaningful for the students so that they understand what the application is and has helped with retention and student involvement it's been really great. None of these girls came into this project thinking that they were inventors or makers or that this kind of thing was something they even wanted to do. All of them, I believe, have been radically transformed just by this idea that the world is invented, right, and designed and that they can participate in designing that world, right? I watched them gain confidence interviewing people, really understanding and delving into design thinking and human-centered design. I watched them struggle through prototyping and then succeed and feel really empowered by that. We have four women here who are ready to take on the world and change the world with the invention that they're making. And this is not something that they would have even considered doing like in September of this year. It's been really amazing like being able to turn a problem into a solution just through uh, engineering. And so I think like Project Invent has taught me that anything that you see out in the world, if you think there's a way that you can fix it, it's totally doable and that there are resources out there um, and people out there willing to support you uh, throughout the journey. This is this is bigger than just us.